Please, Makila, describe hmm. the tango for somebody who has never danced the tango. Oh, wow. Well, uh, tango actually can be whatever you want it to be. But the main thing is the relationship between the man and a woman or the two partners dancing. That's the most important thing. And then you move together. So it's really great because you're sharing an axis, you're sharing, you know, the same kind of balance and you move around and it's great. You're not on your own anymore, you know, you're with someone else and connected in the music, in the art. It's really beautiful. Anyone can learn it. Any person who can walk can dance. Michaela's style of tango is very traditional Argentinian. It's, I feel like I'm in Buenos Aires in one of little cafes and people are dancing. Uh, they're close, but not too close. They're in love, but not really. <laughs> and Michaela can represent all this passion and quality of the dance in her style. She's super um, committed. Whether you're a beginner or an advanced student, she's there. She's making corrections, very meticulous, and she wants to make sure that you do it right. Uh, what I love about Michaela's classes is uh, they provide the basic foundation of the authentic tango, and they're very um, easygoing and fun, and they're just great. Love them. Michaela, as a teacher, is amazing. She's excellent. She's very detailed. She's very authentic. Tango purist. So you'll learn a lot of amazing moves you can do on the like Buenos Aires dance floors. Not just like kicks, but really interesting um, moves that can be led and followed. And she's, she's very careful to give a lot of detail to all her students. Michaela's classes, I've been her student for almost two years, and I like her style of dancing. And she is very um, detailed, and she gives a great uh, approach to the details and overall structure of the dance. And I like this place because it's very friendly. It was an easy place to come as a beginner and feel welcome, and then as you progress, you know, to keep challenging yourself. So. She's an amazing instructor, so I'm very happy that I got into tango because of her. Tango, you're pressed up against other people, and. Uh, you're leading only with the core of your body. I like coming home from work and just forgetting about thinking, just following. It, it adds a whole new dynamic and a whole new challenging point to, to dancing, to any type of partner dancing. It's really beautiful when it's done correctly. And the music is beautiful. It creates very beautiful mosaic on the floor and in legs twisting. It's just a beautiful dance. Tango has a stereotype of being very sultry, dance of the night, sexy, rose in the mouth. I don't know and maybe it is that to some people but for me it's kind of different. What I enjoy is just the fun of it. It's a very complex dance but done to a slow rhythm. You might learn the milonga which is a little more syncopated, more grounded. And I think it's just also just partially the community and who dances it and it's a fun way to get to know people. And this is really a challenge to learning the steps, learning the musicality and I'm kind of the girl next door but I still really love it. So I, you can find, I think, there's something in it for everybody. Get out and tango, it's amazing.